Let's take a look at installing a larger hard drive onto this Lorex NVR. You should purchase your security drives from Lorex. These drives are specifically engineered to be used 24-7. They offer robust and reliable storage for all your security recordings. The purple surveillance drives not only can run 24-7, but also use less power to run than a typical hard drive. First, you should turn off and unplug your NVR. There are no screws on the sides of the NVR holding the black metal cover. All the screws are at the back. There are only four screws that need to be removed. Do not remove the screws around the fan. Those hold the fan in place and do not secure the chassis cover. Remove the four small screws and store them safely for later reinstallation. Slowly and gently remove the cover by sliding it towards the back of the unit. It should slide and lift off with relative ease. Set the cover aside for later reattachment. Look on the bottom of the NVR chassis. There are four screws that hold the hard drive in place. As well, there are four holes that will house the screws to mount an additional hard drive in this NVR. Most Lorex 8-channel and 16-channel NVRs can hold two drives. Simply loosen the four screws on the bottom of the chassis. You don't have to completely remove them because there are slots that allow you to slide the drive off the chassis. Once you have loosened the bolts, you can gently detach the two SATA cables, one black and one blue. Once the drive is completely free, you will need to remove the four screws and reuse them for the new larger storage drive. In this case, we are upgrading to a six terabyte drive. Partially install the four screws on the new drive, then gently push the drive back into the chassis and through the holes and slots. Slide the drive into place. Tighten the screws down with a Phillips head screwdriver. Now gently reattach the two SATA cables. In some cases, you may choose to install these cables before the drive has been fastened to the chassis. Since we've already opened up the chassis, we might as well install a second drive to increase storage capacity even further. In this case, we have another Lorex 24-7 Purple Surveillance hard drive. It is 4 terabytes. Included in the NVR packaging is an additional 4 screws and a blue SATA cable. Loosely secure these screws to the new hard drive. There is already one installed spare cable for the second drive inside the NVR, but we need to attach the blue cable to the motherboard. Carefully insert the cable into the circuit connector. Now connect both SATA cables to the new 4 terabyte drive. Now install the drive. Simply push the drive screws through the holes and then slide through the slots. Tighten the screws to secure the drive. Gently redress the cabling inside the NVR. It is easy to reattach the cover. Simply slide the cover into place. Now reattach the four screws that hold the cover down. Once you plug all the cables back into the NVR, Ethernet from cameras, HDMI, VGA connector, you can now restart the NVR. Once fully rebooted, we can see in the hard drive manager menu that there are two drives recognized by the NVR. If you like, you may reformat the drives one at a time. Simply press the format option under the hard drive manager. That's all there is to installing new drives. Now your Lorex NVR is ready to record surveillance 24-7 for years to come.